Hi there, I'm Aurélie Kalinga with everything you need to know today on the coronavirus. South Africa has recorded its biggest spike in COVID-19 infections with 1,134 new cases. This brings the total number of infections in the country to 19,137. 30 more patients have died and that puts the number of COVID-19 related deaths at 369. Health Minister Swellum Kize says government will now be sending reinforcements to the Western Cape, which is more than 60% of the country's positive cases. Among those infected are four JMPD officers. One officer fell ill during the night shift last week and was tested at Mill Park Hospital. He's since been discharged and is in quarantine. Governor Lesetja Khanyaho has announced more help for distressed South Africans who are in debt with a 50 basis points reduction in the repo rate. This is the latest in a series of rate decreases as people battle to pay their bills in the wake of the coronavirus. While Ekuruleni Mayor Mzwandile Masina says they've made a breakthrough in the fight against hunger during this time, Human Rights Watch is accusing government of bias and overlooking refugees and asylum seekers. It's registered its concerns with the South African Human Rights Commission. Globally, positive cases have surpassed the 5 million mark. Latin America has now overtaken the US and Europe, reporting the largest portion of new daily cases. This represents a new phase in the spread of the virus. For more on the pandemic, you can go to ewn.co.za forward slash coronavirus and like, share and subscribe to our EWN YouTube channel.